Hello, how are you? It's me again. I hope you're doing well. I, uh, uh, I don't know. I'm in a weird mood, as you might have figured out. So, here's my current thinking. I, apparently, am going to have this weekend off. Uh, unfortunately, there's nothing really going on this weekend, so I was thinking of Friday, maybe trying to do a, uh, a, an online gaming session. So I'm thinking of doing like a D20 or, gaming, or just on G Plus gaming session. I haven't decided what game yet, I'm throwing it up to people here who watch to give me some suggestions. No, Shep LaPep, I will not be doing a game where we play Japanese maids. Sorry, being a master. No. I'm thinking D&D, Fate, Lords of Gossamer and Shadow, something like that. Actually, I wouldn't mind doing a D&D 5th edition, but I'm willing to take some feedback and see what people say. Anyways, that's uh, where I'm at at right now. Um, uh, that's my current plan. I'm a little frustrated with work because, well, they give me four days off in a row when I don't need them, but not when I do. So, there's that. Anyway, uh, what else? Not much. Um, just finished, uh, recently, Dino Apocalypse Now and Beyond Dino Apocalypse, the Spirit of the Century novels by Chuck Wendig. And they're awesome. I really enjoyed them. Uh, I love how it just sort of open face accepts all of the pulp action, two fisted uh, stuff without really batting an eye about it. I think that was amazing. Um, but, uh, I think that, uh, uh, I really wouldn't mind doing a fate game set in that, uh, dark future described in the second book, where dinosaurs have taken over the world, and a few, uh, you know, centurions and allies, uh, you know, are fighting for the survival of humanity. I think that would be kind of neat. That's a good game concept, really. Um, but yeah, I, I like how he managed to put some nice emotional resonance in there and complex characters and yet still kept that simple formula of, you know, over the top action. And that is a difficult line to walk, and he does it well. So uh, I'm going to recommend, if you haven't read it, go read those. They're awesome. Uh, they're published by Evil Hat, of course. But you can find them in various formats, even audiobook. So anyway, that's going to be my uh, episode today. It's going to be brief. Got a bit of a toothache, to be honest. But uh, uh, I'll... Uh, I'll talk to you guys later. Subscribe, like, share with all the people, and uh, enjoy.